Why is it so hard to film quality content all the time? It's 3.40 a.m. Planning on going on a run. It's going to be a, a easy five miles. The problem is that it's so freaking dark you can't see anything. I love my iPhone. It just doesn't do a good job of filming in the dark. Did a five mile run, nice and slow, about a 10.30 pace. Um, I'm gonna go up, I'm gonna change, and then I'm gonna head to the gym to do some back and bicep. I don't know if you can talk about what it is, but it's like, it's hard for me to talk. <laughs> I also don't think I'm supposed to film in the gym, so it's pretty hard to get good content in there <laughs> unless I know no one's around. Another problem is so much content that you film just doesn't turn out great. You'll get back, you'll see your video and it's blurry and you're already done with that activity. You've left that place. So now what are you supposed to do? Aside from only using a small portion of the content that I actually film, I have to take all of it and make some sort of a cohesive story that hopefully ends up being interesting. I don't know if I'm explaining this well, so I have an idea. When I get a bunch of film, the first thing I need to do is sort it. I gotta decide what's worth using and keeping and what's garbage and just needs to be thrown away. And then I got this big bucket. It ain't pretty yet, but it's usable. And finally we get this. Yeah, it's still trash, but it looks a lot better. And it's my trash. <laughs> 